Okay, so I am recording. We are going to try something. Oh, got a lot of shit on this desk. We're going to try something that we've never done before. <sighs> In that I've never streamed this before and I've never really done this before. So, it would be a total failure. Blackcom is plugged in. We've got the app sitting there. Just so you see, I'm in the den area where I used to film. Looking high as the orange out of a polar bear cup. I got some cookies. And I doodled this girl in um, statistics. And I really, like, literally have, I have zero idea what I'm doing with this. So, we're just gonna, um, we're just gonna see. I wanted to, like, practice. Um, just, like, practice. This one. No, very blind. So we're going to put this color and I just wanted to practice like doing lines and stuff in using my Wacom tablet. Ooh, that's extra bad. So I watched no tutorials on how to do this. I have zero ideas, but I do go to art school. So you would think that I would be able to like do something. That's not the worst, but it's not the best either. It's better. Um, Um, I said I have literally never done this before. So I thought it would be fun. We are um, all about trying new things here, and um, I really want. I'm supposed to be taking a, like a digital drawing class in the fall, it's called Digital Practices, where we learn essentially to work with the Wacom tablet. Um, so I've had mine for a couple of years now, and I use it for some stuff. I've done little illustrations in the past, just like teeny weeny things, and I, um, I had a class where we had to, like, learn how to use it. But since school, oh, since that class, I haven't really had to do it. And I'm not going to do this too long because I have to leave for class. Um, not digital practices. Different class. 3D animation. Which, if y'all want to watch me do that stuff too. Be more than happy to like record myself doing it. Her eyebrows are intense, and I don't mind. They do not match. I'm going to make this one longer. There we go. This is basically just to help me get a feel of the tablet. Oh, 
Um, if you like know any good tutorials, I would definitely, definitely like to see them because, um, I learn mostly by watching other people and then doing it myself. I think that looks super weird. Not that bad. Um, the next time I probably won't talk through the entire thing. I'll probably just, oh, I think I'm put my lip, lip liner. I'll probably just, um, like speed do it. Not actually speed, but it up. So this is just like a first attempt. This is what I do a lot when I'm working digitally. I'll do something 700 times and uh, just control Z it. So when I was in painting class, I had always had this like uncontrollable urge to um, control Z things. I could feel myself like tapping constantly in my mind. And uh, the teacher would always make fun of me for it. Well, you know, zooming was like a really good idea. I, don't know why I didn't do that previously. When I was a teen, and the tween drawing faces was my favorite thing. I was super obsessed with drawing eyeballs, and I would do it just constantly. Just constant eyeballs. So I wonder. That says something about me. Like as an adult. The computer does not like this. It's just, oh, it's just gonna get over. This is gonna be hard. My lines. Not great. Nice. Got like a really intense thing going on right here. Not going to be that intense. This is better. I do not have high expectations for this. I don't even know how to go about coloring this. That'll probably be a different video. We can just get the lines in. And you guys can come along with me on this journey. It's doing this drawing. Yeah, 
I have noticed that when I draw it digitally, sometimes um, I have to do my mouse in a certain direction, or I have to do the pen in a certain direction, or I just can't, can't handle it. Also, I should tell you that I drew her arms and her legs, I think, 20 times each. They still don't look good. I'm going to take the background sketch off and this is going to look extra bad. So how are you guys doing? I am uh, a little stressed out. I uh, realized that I got like, we're just going to do like a paw basically for her hand right now. Uh, I have like a month left of school and I have, A, I am in no way prepared for um, my statistics final, which I realize is like a month away, but if you like just gave me a final based on the stuff we've learned so far, I would, um, I would be up Coop Creek without a paddle to put it without swears. <clears throat> and um, I just uh, I'm just not anyway. Like, it's a baggy shirt, all right. I took drawing, like a drawing class. I took several drawing classes. I'm not taking figure drawing because um. Figure drawing at the college level means that you have to draw nude people. And I am exceptionally uncomfortable being in a room with nude strangers. So, um, I talk to my counselor. Because anytime that you feel uncomfortable at school, go talk to your counselor, man. If you're in school, if you're not in school, and you feel uncomfortable, get yourself a counselor. I have several. Uh, so anyways, I talked to my academic counselor about it, and I was like, you know, I feel super uncomfortable with this. Uh, drawing already makes me, like, crazy anxious. So what can I do? And she was like, hey, you don't have to take figure drawing. You just have to take something. So why not find a different class? That like suit your needs and we'll still get you like we just want you to learn you know what I mean um, so I talked to the head of my department and he was like well we're doing a digital drawing class so um, I have no idea how to draw shoes so we're this is something we're gonna have to learn together but all right who that's a hoof She's got a hoof. She's a centaur. Oh, yeah. Okay, so. Let's take the background off. Hey! That is, um, that is a person. Let's put a different background in. Let's do this the right way. Okay. Solid color. Up her there. Okay. So. That is um, not the worst. And this has been 15 minutes. So we're going to stop here. I realize that this is like the sh sh not greatest drawing ever. But um, I feel like it's a start for me in doing this. So um, next time we do this, we're going to color it. So I'm going to do this with you guys entirely. I'm going to learn how to use this thing. In the meantime, I'm going to watch some tutorials on the YouTubes. Like I said, suggest me some. And um, we will color her next and you guys can come on this uh, doodling journey with me. Okay? I'll see you guys later. Bye.